like a cardinal sin to like ever press new game or load while this theme is playing. You have to at least let it play out once, right? So that's what we're gonna do. Look at how smooth that looks. Oh my goodness. Alright, well, we're gonna do the exact same thing we did before. Also, my mic is like extremely sensitive. I went to like the red there. I need to be careful with that. Maybe just turn down the volume of my mic a bit. Alright, let's do it. So, funny thing, like, the reason why I stopped playing this game is because, uh, I was in the middle of playing it, right? And then, uh, my sister borrowed my Switch, and then by the time I got it back, Shadowbringers had come out, so it was like, there was no way. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, now we're in that sort of lull in between, like, uh, patch periods for Final Fantasy fourteen. so, uh, I feel totally comfortable getting back into this, and I've actually gotten the uh, the, the Steam version of the game as well. So yeah, that's that's what we're playing now. And uh, this video, we're just probably just gonna go through the, like as far as I've gone through on Switch already, and then continue from there. I'm probably just gonna cut out most of this, honestly. But uh, it's gonna be a nice catching up on all the stuff that I might have forgotten in the meantime. <laughs> I almost forgot how much I hated this character. <laughs> At least I know I'll get to kill him soon. Alright, time to kidnap some more people. Yeah, I'll be happy to go into the sewers with you because you danced a little, you know? I just, I love, it's like my favorite pastime. Alright, is there anyone else I could kidnap? What about you? You actually are slightly stronger, so maybe. Oh, no. Lightning dust. Nope. How about you, old man? You want to come with me instead of the elderly woman? Okay, ma maybe I think I kind of like the woman better. No, nope, but you know, whatever. It's a short term arrangement. the chest back there. Oh my god, yes. Music. Get some of the old man. Boost mode. My god, this game looks... So much smoother. Okay, I know I know Primrose is uh works better with magic, but I mean I'm just trying to save my SP right now. Although I shouldn't, because I'll just I'll get it all back when I level up, and I should level up a couple times in here. What the hell is that? It really hurts. Ow, it's going to kill me. <laughs> what? 
What the f Okay. Ah, damn it. I'm back here. Alright, it's fine. That, that must be like a rare spawn or something, right? Because there's no way. <laughs> Oh yeah, I forgot, there's just a peddler here in the middle of the freaking sewers. Yo, I totally forgot that happened. Man, I'm gonna kill this guy so bad. それのようにフリムロゼお前は取っておきだったのかもったいないもったいないよフリムロゼ今まで散々お世話になったわね Oh yeah, let's go. Oh yeah, I forgot, you just bring a chair out of nowhere. Come on, old man, own your... Yeah, there you go, that's the perfect time to use that. I don't have any AOE of my own, do I? Ooh, I do have this. Oh! That was extremely effective. I think you're weak to daggers. Hmm. Oh, damn, old man. Holy <laughs> Oh, I can now use, uh, learn new skills. <laughs> wow. I don't remember it being that easy last time I did this. All right, so I've been playing for like, well, it says like three and a half hours. It's kind of neat that it shows you your total play time up there. Uh, but yeah, and uh, I've been enjoying the hell out of my, I can't believe I put down this game what nine months ago however long it's been oh my god i am i'm having so much fun it's also so smooth on on the pc but uh i've pretty much caught up to where i was on the switch i might have like picked up something or maybe done a side quest or two differently uh from my last playthrough but for the most part it's pretty much the same so yeah we just picked up ophelia looks like we're gonna we're gonna keep heading in our kind of like counterclockwise direction to pick up the rest of the party members so oh there's fast travel that's neat uh so uh looks like we're picking up hanets and then we'll go down to uh tarion and uh alfin afterwards so yeah we're just going to continue on with that sort of pattern i suppose looks like you have a side quest Konnichiwa. How nice to meet a new face! I am Miles! I was recently done the great art of being appointed to the Knights Ardante. I'm probably mispronouncing that. In fact, my late father, Restim, was also a member of the Knights Ardante. Though he was stripped of his cloak for the crime of deserting in the midst of battle. Even now, after all these years, it's difficult to believe such slander to be true. My father would never have abandoned his fellow Knights. Okay. Um. Sure. Healing. Oh, it's a healing great meeting. You know what? Fine, whatever. <laughs> so that's another thing I've noticed about the side quests in this oh. game is that they're very indirect. Like, um, they'll give you like a basic premise, and you kind of have to figure out what to do based on that. And it's very unclear. Like sometimes, like usually, it involves using one of the characters, like 
special abilities. So I don't know. I'll come back to that. Right now I just kind of want to focus on getting all eight party members before I kind of focus on other stuff. Alright, looks like we're heading west. Man, this game looks so incredibly beautiful on PC, especially like it's so smooth and crisp. Let's see. Man, I need, uh, I haven't run across anyone who can use axes yet, so that'll be helpful. Man, I can't do anything here as her. Uh, I can donate, I guess. Nah. I don't need a rest. I'm probably gonna level up soon anyway. Just do it. <laughs> It's a good thing he wasted his turn. I like how ridiculously strong our magic Cyrus is. Also, really appreciate his ability that reduces random encounters, which is just, it's so nice when you're just trying to get from place to place. Or trying to figure out how to get to those like obscure treasure chest locations that require you to kind of like find the secret passages like kind of hidden away in the, in like the cracks of the walls and stuff. Also really appreciate his ability to find out everyone's weaknesses. Like Cyrus is just He's so helpful. I am out of SP. Wow. I hope I level up soon. I don't know man, I just I love saving up my items for no discernible reason. I also abuse <laughs> collecting money as much as I can as Tressa. <laughs> Even it's probably not the right thing to do. I do it like every fight. <laughs> ah, Primrose is nowhere near being. I should have just slept at the end. What was I thinking? All right, well, fine. That's fine. We have 20 of these clumps. Oh man, Cyrus needs some too, hold on. How close is he to leveling up? Oh, I need to go to status. Oh, he's literally 1 EXP. He, he'll, he'll be fine. Ooh, it's a cave. Ooh, it's level 25. I'm considerably less interested now. South. All right. We'll go pick up this chest real quick. Ooh. Are these rat men? Oh, what do you know? I happen to have Ophelia with me, so light damage is not a problem. I I can literally cast like once. <laughs> Yes. 
Oh crap, no. I swear I unlocked the AoE ability for her. I guess not. You know what, fine, I'll just summon you. I'll probably pick up somebody else in the next town anyway. Anyway. Alright, you know what? Uh Lightning. Oh look, they were weak to that. They even killed them. Oh, there we go. Those are the level ups I need. Alright. <laughs> I need to unlock stuff on Ophelia. Please. I, I swear I unlocked this. Let's see, what else do I need? Revive. That's probably not. All of them, huh? 50 SP though. Ability to reflect one elemental damage. That's probably helpful for like really specific fights. I'm gonna just grab this. Make sure I didn't forget to equip stuff. All status enchantments you receive will last for one additional turn. It's interesting. Alright. South it is. I'm probably going to be playing this game in really large chunks until I finish it. Like, especially now with Final Fantasy XIV, I'm just kind of waiting for the uh, the next patch cycle. It's it's basically the perfect time to just be playing a bunch of other games. Hello. Headgear. Eh. No, no thanks. Hmm. Like how the first thing I do when I get into town is just start trying to, like, kidnap and buy stuff off of people. I don't need to sleep at the end right now. Hey, look, a battle axe that I can't use because no one uses axes. Actually, maybe Hanet will. Hanet probably uses an axe. She's supposed to be like a like a hunter, right? She probably uses a bow and an axe. If I had to guess. But yeah, definitely. Considering all the bows here. <laughs> an empty. Who would buy? I guess that's like the equivalent of buying a wallet. I guess. Arcane bow. I think I already have one of these. An arcane hatchet. <sighs> I understand it now. For what reason would such a beast come to our woods? It's one of those characters. They have to speak like that. Doth this herald some greater ill that comes our way? Okay. Her name is Hana, and she is a hunter, one of the last descendants of her proud and ancient clan. She makes her home here in Swarki, deep in the dark wood. This season, Huntress roams the forest with Lin, her fast friend, though her mind often turns to her master who left the village one year ago on a dangerous hunt from which he has yet to return. When a local noble came seeking aid, she answered the call and was tasked with hunting the vicious beast that plagues the nearby forests. And so she makes for the Whisperwood with her loyal companion, Linda, at her side. She will need fierce allies on the path she has chosen. I don't know if Tressa is considered fierce, but you know. Um. Oh, no, that's the wrong person. Uh. <laughs> no, maybe we should... I don't want Primrose to get, like, too ahead of everyone, so maybe we should actually replace her. Oh! You cannot replace your party leader at this time. You can arrange your party later by visiting the local tavern. Oh. 
Well, that's fine. You just give me an excuse to bring Primrose along everywhere. That's totally fine. We'll replace Tressa, even though money is awesome. よかった。まだ出発してなかったか。ああ、それはな。ザタ。可愛い弟子の顔を見てから出発しようと思ってな。また冗談を。Should, should I be voicing this? You know what? Uh, fine. Ah, a good question, Dad. We'll just voice them twice. Once in, once in Japanese for the weeps like me, and once in English for everyone else. The West cometh from none other than the Knights Ardante. We just heard about them in uh, Flames Grace. Uh, the hunt will take us to distant land, and the beast we pursue in <laughs> is a fearsome one. Didn't know that was a word. So. I see. <laughs> Looking not so gloom, girl. I'm no Tyro with green arrows with bruises on his bow arm. This is really awkward to say. <laughs> I'll do the deed and be back before two moons have passed. Still no smile. Tis not the hunt that concerneth me. Thou intends to stop and off somewhere along the way. Someone has a, a gambling or drinking problem, maybe? Here and there, mayhap. On the last hunt, thou gamblest away thy purse and came back a poorer man than thou left. Poorer in coin, maybe. Did make a few wagers at the arena in Victor's Hollow. And learned that while I have a keen eye for assessing the strength of beast, I am quite at a loss with men. A valuable lesson that was cheaply bought. <laughs> Not so cheap at the end. Eliza had to pay in thy debts, and thy only finished paying her back this last moon if. <laughs> Promising me, master, no more foolish gift. I can't keep a straight face when attempting to talk like this. What's funny is that in Japanese, they're I'm pretty sure they're not even talking in like this this weird dialect. It's just whoever localized it was like, yeah, they need to speak like this. <sighs> Thou just mad at that one up. Come on now, girl. Thou art too young by half for such world weary size. <laughs> Must thou makest our parting so gloomy? Now I just sound like a robot. I turn to thee, Hagen, looking after Master, for he can rarely be bothered to look in after himself. <laughs> I, I, didn't, I didn't need a voice that one. <laughs> Even thou takest her side against me, old friend. He knoweth good sense when he heareth it. I'm, I'm not 
I'm not gonna voice Hagen Das over here. <laughs> Hyant? Hyant. Hail Hyant. I was saying Hyant, but it's like Hyant? Have you come to see us off? Ah, Eliza. I've come in to warn Master about straying from the path. And I thank you for that. I did not have the leaves to pay another debt like that. Is that is that seriously what the currency is in this game? Leaves? Have I not a single ally in this infernal village? I am your friend, but also a knight Ardante and your client. You would do well not to forget this. We're totally gonna like fight the knights Ardante, aren't we? Not for a moment, most honorable lady Eliza of the illustrious knights Ardante. Why? I clearly haven't been uh, voicing dialogue in a while. I mean, I just got done like doing like a 26 page um, script for an astrologian guide, but clearly it hasn't helped my speaking at all. Fear not, I'll keep him out of trouble. I'll have him fill his evenings penning a detailed account of our adventures on the hunt. Taking care and may thine arrow strike true. I shall look he for the force till the day of thy return. Oh, Thank you, knee, my girl, and farewell. I am not looking forward to voicing more of Heinitz. Ha ha ha. I can't even say her name properly. I'm sorry. A year hath passed since that day. In all that time, Master could only be bothered to send in a single letter. Hainetto, tis me, thy revered master, Mrs. Me. I won't bore thee with any blather about the weather or the season. Who knoweth when this will even arrive after all? For three months now, I have pursued a, the trail of thy beast, sotten by the knight Ardante. A beast by the name of Red Eye. That's their name for it, at least wise. As for its true name, is if it, it even hath one, I none can say. But on my father's bow, I swear tis the most vexing quarry I've ever had it the misfortune to hunt in. I'm trying my best, guys. It eludeth mine every trap, and though thou may thinketh me mad for saying this, I swear it can even sense every move I make. I know not if it is human intelligence or pure animal instinct, but either way, it refuses to be caught. Still, we appear to have annoyed it sufficiently that it is moving on to new pastures. Judging from its behavior, I believe it meant it to make for the lands around Stoneguard. I will be frank with thee, my girl, for thou always seems to be always has been able to see through my pretenses. The chase will be hard and the hunt will not end it soon. But fear not, for end it, it shall. Hast thou ever known your master to fail in, in a hunt? And so I pray, I ask thee, my dear apprentice, pray look after the village until I return. Eh? Can we just speak? 
Zanta Yori. Oh, and be not a worry ward. Always thy friend and teacher, Zeata. Never heard Master admitted that any hunt be difficult. Either this red eye is truly the most formidable of beasts. Or he stopped in every gambler's den from here to Stone Guard. Well, then he must be on a winning streak, right? Yeah. But no, Master liked to act in like a fool, but when it comes to the hunting, if he saith he will catch it his quarry, then catch it he, it he will. It is so difficult. <laughs> yes, I know, Linde. Master entrusted the safety of the village to me. My duty now is to the villagers. Come on, let us visit the headman and see if anyone hath need of my bow. I haven't taken the day off of my training in 10 moons. One day I'll be Master Zantan's number one apprentice. Just thou waiting. Alright. Alright, you guys don't have anything to say to me. That's fine. That's cool. Oh, look, there's a. Actually, I can't tell. Is that a cat or a dog? Might not even be either. It's very possible. Huh. Hey, no visitors allowed. Okay. I'll come back with all Barrack and beat the shit out of you. We'll see who visits then. Yeah. Headman, how might my bow serve its need today? Yeah. Every day thou's come here seeking work, sometimes I wonder if thou art truly thy master's apprentice. But jesting aside, no, there is no hunt today. So Is there aught else I might do? Hmm. Well, the youngsters are always in need of lessons. Thou could give them a lesson or two in bowmanship. The clan of the Darkwood inherited the lore of the beasts and the trees. Yet today only thou and Santa can truly use that lore. Why? When I was a mere stripling. <laughs> yes, yes, I have heard your stories before and know how long they are. <laughs> Long-winded tales are the vice of many an old man. My apologies, child. But if thou could show in the youngsters the way of the hunt, I would be grateful. I saw two of them waiting eagerly in the square. Perhaps thou couldst start it with them. Eh. It will be done. Okay. Hana can use beast to provoke people into battle. Huh. Okay. Ike. Oh, okay. So I'm like an animal, um, uh, like a beast trainer, I guess. Restore health, blinding call, that sounds cool. I like how he's like, yeah, go train them with the bow, and I just sick my pets on them. <laughs> like... That's not what he said. He said, use, use your bow. Train them with the bow. Oh. Yeah. Thou must be more cautious than ever, for thou not knowest just enough to get and die into trouble. Okay. Uh, thank you, please, another. Alright, boy, you're next. <laughs> Like, he, he's literally, he has fists. I'm just like, yeah. Here you go. Well, 
dost thou feel is more attuned to thy surroundings. Ah. Yes, I feel much more able to anticipate where Swift Quarry might darst next as I lay on the ground bleeding to death. Yokata. Very good. An important lesson that. Huntress Hind! What is it? The head man sent me to find thee. He said he must speak it with thee right away. He's literally like maybe like 10 meters away. Come on. I know where he is, little girl. Oh my god. Headman, you wish to see it in me. I like how I'm so used to the olden speak that I'm like, <laughs> I'm like adding on syllables to words that don't even have it. Yes, a request hath come in from the uh, of Lord Karan, Kairan, would seem a beast hath strayed into his provincial forest, and he will it gone. Just so, he asked for our best hunter. And while Master Zanta is off on the hunt that meaneth thee. Oh. Understood. Tanomunzo? Always remember height. Since time immoral, ours have been a village of great hunters and huntresses. Yes, far and wide beyond the edges of the dark wood our home. The bard sang it of our exploits in all the realm lauded fair Swarky as the home of the true hunter. Is that not how it went? Soka. Ho ho, have I told it that many times? Long winded tales, my dear. <laughs> Are the vice of an old man, yes. As for the hunt, I am ready when needed. Um. Excellent. Lord Kairan's messenger awaiteth inside. He will telleth thee all thou needest to know. I will speak to him at once. Hainit, prithee do not master Zanta with thee not. Ah. Of course, thank ye. Okay. Domo. My apologies for the urgency of the matter, but monsters pray, uh, pay little heed to the convenience of men. Yeah. I am here to serve. Tell me more of this beast. Yeah. Alright, uh, your quarry is to be a fearsome beast that has wandered into the whisper board from the gods nowhere. monster that has strayed from his home. Yeah. I, just this morning, a merchant and an injured companion fetched me at our manor in a frightful shape. As one man told it, the other was in no condition to speak. The caver- their- <laughs> God. I can- th <laughs> Their caravan had been waylaid by the beast and they were the only survivors. Hmm. How dost thou know that this creature was responsible? So they were. Lord Kairan's scholars were called upon to investigate that matter. From the merchant's testimony, they concluded the men were attacked by a savage beast known as a ga Gariz Gazarma. I have heard of this creature. Its beautiful world would make it unlikely fit for the tranquil whisper wood. <laughs> His lordship is most anxious to protect his subject, needless to say. He seeks the help of the most capable hunter in this village. And so, in, Mr. In, in Master Zanta's absence, we turn to you. What say you, Heinitz? Will you free our fair province of this unholy menace? Shoujista. Tell him thy lord that I shan't fail him. <laughs> Indeed. There's a dignity about you that Master Zanta lacks, but I see you share his passion for your calling. I hope you will continue to inherit only his better qualities. <laughs> Master is a fine teacher. He showeth by example both with Hunter Ott 
and aren't not to do it. Can we please speak <laughs> normally? It would seem we're in safe hands indeed. Oh. Yes, thou art. And so I must do my duty and hunt the beast. Soka. Thine offer is a generous one, yet the path ahead is fraught with danger. How curious. Lim judgeth thee worthy. It is not often she warmeth to strangers. I shall accept in thine offer, leading me thy strength in battle. The monster hath been sighted in the Whisperwood. It is there we must go. Yay, finally. Huh. Hey, no visitors allowed. Not if I have anything to say about it. Ike. How would a monster find its way in here? Its nose? What are you hiding, man? Let me in. <laughs> hey, I just beat up like your husband or something. Oh, no, never mind. I just beat up your brother or something. Or your father, maybe. Ben's uh, sure to stow in thy treasure securely before they go on missing. Oh, really? Uh, none of your active party members can open this chest. Oh. Well. You, he, he really did. I'll come back when I have the thief. <laughs> we'll see how secure that stays. Ah. Uh, 12th? That's half of my... Jeez. Alright. Someone had a bow I could buy. I hope it's not one of these people that I've knocked out. Oh, I don't have Tressa. Crap. Alright. Um. Bar. Alright. Let me just... Take Tressa real quick. Alright, you have a battle axe. Oh yeah, what weapons can you use? Can you use axes? Yes. Hmm. It might be one of these people that I've knocked out. And I can't leave the village. Fine, I'll, I'll buy some head gear. I even got a nice little discount there. Yeah, an arcane bow. You know what? Sure. I got a nice discount on that too. What about you? An arcane hatchet? Sure, why not? No discount this time. Panic arrow? That doesn't sound very helpful. Poison Slash. I'll buy a Healing Grape for 20% uh, off. Why not? I don't, I don't know how many uses I have left. I think it shows me actually. Hold on. I have one use left. Ugh. You know, I'll, I'll keep the elderly woman. She's quite helpful in a pinch. Alright, let's get Cyrus back because he's really helpful to have. SP? You think SP is useful? You know what? This is fine. You don't need SP probably. I don't know. We'll figure it out later if we do. No extra accessories. I guess I should get in the habit of unequipping stuff on the party members I'm not using. Bronze armor isn't even that much better. You know what? Sure. It's only 600. And 
she's low level, so. Good, we're finally done talking. I can finally give my stupidity a rest. <laughs> I don't know why it's so hard for me to to speak, old and speak. This is the right way, right? I'm just assuming it's this way. Also, I noticed there's like a chest way back in the beginning. Uh, how about Nax? Yeah, there we go. Anyway, I'll just do this. Oh, stats! I should actually take a look at her skills. What, did, what can she get? Heavy lightning damage. Alright. Single phone to act at the end of the turn for two turns. That's actually probably really nice for some boss fights. Single foe with a bow. Otherwise lethal... Uh, attacks will instead leave the target with one HP. Wait, attack a single foe with a bow. Otherwise lethal attacks will instead leave the target with one HP. Oh, mercy strike. I get it. So that means th we can probably capture monsters, huh? That's so much fun. I don't know why so many Japanese games like having like a monster catching system, but I almost never like doing it because it takes too much effort. Uh, attacks all foes five to eight times with a bow. Don't I have that already? Ra oh, this is random foes. This is all of them. Okay. Increase all allies' critical hit rate and accuracy for two turns. That sounds really nice. She has some interesting stuff. Okay, I'm very curious about this chest I passed up earlier. There's a chest back here, right? Am I crazy? Yeah, it's right there. H how? Man, you must have to go all the way around, man. Force Rat Kid! Oh, you are le uh, weak to lightning. Be slow. Yeah, here we go. Capture. Chance of success. Sure, sure I'll capture a ratkin. It's not weird at all. Wow, that really hurt. You know, I kind of want to capture this. Beast Lord, capture. Freaking Heinz is like a Pokemon trainer, I guess. How the? How do we get to that chest? Oh, here, no, never mind. No, I. I there must be some path back here. Honestly, but when I actually get to it, it's just gonna have like a healing vape or something okay. really inconsequential in it, but it just it bothers me. <laughs> oh, they don't stick around like um like with Primrose and Ophelia's like companions. They only come out for one turn. That's kind of unfortunate. 
chest look at it how how like i see i see maybe like the inklings of a, of a oh oh yeah what what did i say there's gonna be a healing grape in there what did i say <laughs> where are we going i swear i ran to a dead end when i went north I shouldn't. I didn't summon you to freaking swack someone with your. So Lin, it looks like, doesn't have any charges, which is kind of neat. Look at me trying to save SP. Yeah, that's what I summoned you for. Pendant return once they came. Sad times. You know, I'm actually so close to the village still that I might as well just go take someone else with me. <laughs> oh, those people I knocked out are probably uh, awake by now, right? Okay, I think that's a dog. Uh, yeah, lure. Head bash. That sounds dangerous. Head bash as well. What about you? Luminescence. Hmm. <laughs> this looked like a dance I saw at a tavern in a desert town. I mean, yeah, it does, huh? Funny. How that works out. I should go back to Atlas Dam and get that elderly woman again. She's actually really nice when she actually casts magic, not just whacking people with her cane or whatever. Okay, I swear I went down this path and it was a dead end, so like. Oh, this is an actual path, okay. I gotcha now. I don't even know what what does your townsperson do? Man, you are away from Flame Grace, aren't you? It's actually been a while since I saved. It's been like 45 minutes. Yeah. Oh. That's unfortunate. Hey, look, there's wolvies. <laughs> Spirits have in mercy. 
This was not done in the name of survival. The Kizar must have sought not food, it sought sport and wanton slaughter. It slew with these men and beasts for no reason other than a fearsome show of its dreadful power. <sighs> I see thou trembles, little one. Thine heart is filled with fear. Thou witnessed what the beast did. It made thee bear witness. Patience, I shall return and attend to the fallen. But first, they shall be avenged. Hmm? Will thou protect them, friend, until my return? Arigato. Thank thee. I shall return anon. To eat, to be eaten, this is the fate and the privilege of any beast of the forest. A life for a life, so it hath been since the dawn of time. Hmm. But to slain for sport, for pleasure or greed, is to be is to betray in the law of nature. Each time a creature taketh more than it needeth, a part of the force dieth. I hunt not merely to keep in the Lord Chiron's people safe. Uh. I hunt to save the force itself. Alright, sure. I will say, Heinz's story hasn't, like, really kicked off for me yet, as much as, like, the other characters so far, but, I mean, it can't start off every one of the characters with, like, really, like, in the thick of things, I guess, so. Some stories need time to ramp up, so. We shall see. Where's this go? Oh. <laughs> All right, villager, show your stuff. That's that's not why I brought you along. I brought you to cast magic, friend. Huh? <laughs> I kind of want to get this. Never, never mind. <laughs> never mind. I was about to say I kind of want to get this box, and then I killed it. <laughs> It's spiriting plum. I totally forgot. Oh, there's nothing down that path. Well, gee. Alright, so let's see. Got this. Okay. You know what? You save your SP. Let's see, you, let's see. Do we want to capture any of these? Wait, probably Rackin too, right? Yeah. Not gonna... 
I should have let Ophelia attack instead of Cyrus because now I just realized I don't have very much SP on Cyrus. Ooh, I picked up a vest. I don't think that's actually that helpful. Oh, it is. Slightly better. Oh, yeah, that looks like the right way. Well then, pick up this chest real quick. Healing Grape. Energizing Pomegranate. Slightly better. Alright, I definitely need to pop this, though, if we're going into the fight. I just love how in all of these, uh, at least the very beginning dungeons for each of the characters, there's just some random peddler in here selling you grapes and stuff. Oh, that is disgusting looking. <sighs> that is enough. Thou scarest me not, beast. Is it not so? Thou wert driven from thine home. Bested by a beast more powerful. Thou fledst and foundest thee here. So then. I understand thy pain all too well. Yeah. But to turn thy grief and anger against innocent creatures, that is a sin of men. It was thy duty to adapt to the force let it find it a place for you. Instead, thou wouldst rip out its heart and claim it as thine own. This cannot be forgiven. <sighs> thou hast trespassed, beast. And in the name of the Force, I visit judgment upon thee. Oh, that's even grosser. <laughs> All right, let's see what we're dealing with here. About 10,000 health. Beast Lord. <laughs> yeah, untamable. All right. Well, you know, just thought I'd just clear that up real quick. This does a double strike. Ooh, that's quite a bit of damage. Ow. Oh, ow, ow. Okay. Wow. Alright, Ophelia, looks like you're on healing duty, so it's holy crap. Can we please cast magic? <laughs> Wow, this uses 25 SP, I just realized. I should not be using that all willy-nilly. Hmm. Alright, let's see what we're dealing with. Alright, ice. I can work with that. It should... It should be weak to some other kind of magic as well. If it was my guess, it'd probably be thunder. But, you know. Ooh, a buffs. See, I can... I could break its guard, but that wouldn't mean very much, because it's already going last next turn, so... Alright, dancer skills. Get Cyrus bumped up. 
Oh, look, you did something useful. Wow, that does nothing. Yeah, I'll do damage. I can buff uh, next turn. Man, these villagers don't do any damage. I guess they're only really good for uh, exploiting weaknesses. Bunch of skills. Let's do this. That did not do as much damage as I hoped. Lion dance on Hanet? Sure, why not? I'm gonna assume that that buff applies to uh, her pets as well. Oh, sh no. Okay, uh. This restores health. I wonder how much. That's a lot of damage. No. I think I'll just keep refreshing dances on Primrose, since she can't really exploit weaknesses until uh, we break its guard again. Actually, I should probably give uh, a plum to Cyrus on Primus's next turn. Mm. Ophelia is going to need a plum here too soon. Me or her? Yeah, I'll just do it on myself. I'm pretty sure I do more magic damage since I'm higher level. Pop this on myself. Ooh, yeah, there we go. Almost twelve hundred damage right there. This seems to do a lot of damage, so. Oh yeah, there we go. Wow, I should have been doing that earlier. <laughs> I just wasted that plum on Cyrus, but that's fine. That was like the smoothest boss fight I've had so far, except for like the first one with Primrose. Like the pirates with Tressor was actually really rough. Thy life is given not in vain, for it will free the others. Thou art of the force now, and in the force not is lost. Come in, my friends, this life belongeth to all. The animals that eateth the grass becometh food for the animals that eateth meat. 
その肉を食べる獣もより強い獣の糧となる turn, そして強き獣も死ねば他の獣たちの命をつなぐ糧となる dieth, それだけではない屍は土へと草を茂らせることになる His flesh feedeth the soil, the grass, his blood becometh sap, his bones wood. その草をまたそれを食べる獣が糧とする。He becometh the food of the plant eaters, and the circle beginneth once more. 森に住まうものみんながつながっているんだ。Lives entwined, a tapestry woven anew each dawn, every thread a part of the whole. Listen, Heinz. Being a hunter means taking lives, but we do it so we might live. Never forget it, it is thy sacred duty to live it on. Donna Tokide mo zetai ni ikinuke. To survive it and honor those who fell by thine own arrows. Honto, Kari no koto dake wa ii koto yu. As long as he speaketh only of hunting, he is the wisest of men. いつもそうだと助かるのだがな。If only that were all he cared about. さて、帰るとしよう。襲われた人たちを弔わないと。The hunt is over. Now it is time to tend to the fallen. Oh boy. You're just waiting here? <laughs> What? Yeah. You look well. I trust the hunt was a success. You are very bold, my friend. Like. It's very possible your ass could have gotten eaten too. <sighs> The beast will trouble thee no more. These graves. Hmm. <sighs> I took the liberty of digging them while I waited for your return. <sighs> Thank thee, but I have a request. Leaving the beast be, letting the forest reclaim it them. That is the way of the wood. Hi. As you wish, my lady. Hmm? Hey, look, it's Wolfie, friend. Hagen does. Hagen, thou's returned to us. <laughs> I, I, I did not need to do that. Masako. Where is Master? Has something befallen him? Oh, please tell me I get to I get it summon him too. Like, I want to use Hagen Dawes in battle. <laughs> He's confused and frightened. Thou didst run here. Did, did, didst thou not? Okay, yeah. I can speak and alone. Doth Master needeth my help. It's alright. Easy boy. Ah. Master is in trouble, that much is clear. I must hasten to his side. If anything were to happen, it'll. Hagen, can dust guide me to、uh, Master? <laughs> Whatever hath befallen him, we shall save him, thou and I. Head north out of the village. Oh, wow. I really feel like I should just part ways with these guys. They're not very good. I wonder how many、um, creatures I can have at once. This forest ratkin is not that good. The other two, well, I actually haven't used the AOE one. So thou art going after Zanta.
この子が助けを求めてきたからな。I can hear Kim seeking my help. In this letter, he said he was bound for Stone Guard. We shall begin our search there. あのザンターが窮地に追い込まれたにわかには信じがたいが I pray that it's no more serious than the ill founded wager that left him unable to pay his innkeeper ハーゲンがお前のもとへ駆けつけたのだ確かにただごとではない For Hawkins comes all this way alone I cannot help but fear the worst 気をつけて行ってこい Pray thee take his care あ We will ただし無理はするでないぞそこはザンタに似なくてよい。And Don nothing foolish, Don as Zanta saith, child, not as he would do it. 心に留めておく、村長。Thank you, Chief, fear not for us. では行ってくる。必ず師匠と一緒に戻る。We shall be back before the next moon with Master at our side. だから無事でいろ、師匠。Stay safe, Master. And so did the Huntress Highness set out on her journey, her master having vanished hunting the baleful red eye, and now fell to her to find him and bring him home. What fate awaits her on the road ahead, only the gods can say. I kind of want to capture more stuff. <laughs> Alright, so it、uh, looks like.、Uh, wow, where are we? Yeah, we need to head to Boulderfall. Boulderfall it is. Well,、oh, these are scaled pretty high. What level are we actually? We're level 15. Maybe by the time we get the other two party members, we'll be high enough to tackle some of the other stuff. Hey, look! Side quests! Oh. Though not a true researcher, this passionate youth has journeyed to the woodlands to、uh, learn the legends of the beast tamers. Yeah. Are you a traveler? I'm also on a journey of sorts. My name's Ashland. I heard a rumor of a monster tamer who lives in this village. I want to learn more about the monster tamers, but haven't a clue to ask. Um. Yeah. I am a student of the history of the great houses. Needless to say, history is dominated by those great and powerful families. To understand them is to understand how our realm came to be as it is. Sure.、Oh. A historian who carefully researches noble houses from their humble beginnings to their various deeds and indiscretions throughout the generations. Precisely why he conducts his research is a mystery to everyone, himself included. Well, he, he's looking for monster tamers. Maybe? Ooh,、uh. Very fond of. Oh, here we go. A scholar beast. I'm very fond of animals, indeed. I know all there is to know about keeping them, even wild ones. But alas, these days I have neither the time nor the coin for such pursuits. There's just some things I won't stand for. This is one of them. Oh, come on, man. How to train a tiger? Like how, I like how one minute he's like, hey, man, this is not something I will stand for. The next minute he's like, yeah, man, I'm totally. Um. Man, I should, I should save <laughs> before I just completely mess up my reputation. I've actually never messed up my reputation so badly that I needed to fix it, but I can't imagine it's that easy. I'm sure I'll find out one of these days. Actually, you know what? Can I just guide you? That'd be more helpful. Alright. Let me move you down like a few m e t e r s What? What? I thought. I'm so confused. Alright. 
This guy has the information you need, friend. Hold on. Journal. Where are we right now? Flatlands, coastlands, sunlands, woodlands. Probably that one. Heard of the legend of a month's tamer who lives in this village. I want to ask more about them, but I haven't a clue who to ask. Maybe him? What, what, what's mm. your problem? In faith, I've been apprentice long enough. It's high time I took the hunter's rights. But a man's not a hunter true unless he's bagged a giant boar. Truth be told, I don't see myself doing that too soon. You want me to get a boar for you? That's not how rights work. You're supposed to do it yourself. Mm. I'm longing to visit my husband. He's working in Boulderfall. But the way their path, uh, but the way their path is through dangerous woods, and I dare not go alone. If only I could find a kind soul to escort me there. A little passive, there. But uh, I am actually, I am going to Boulderfall, aren't I? That's where Tarion's right. Yeah. So I'll pick you up after I figure out how to deal with this fellow. Sit. Yeah. No, not you. I'm. Konnichiwa. Okay, I am just. I don't get it. Alright, part ways. Take care now. Cause I can't. I can't guide either of these two to him. So actually, maybe the elder. I like how the I like how the village elders like yeah man I can go on an adventure like I don't need to watch the village or anything no maybe the other way around Sick. all right hmm. no how about you <sighs> Thirty-six percent. No thanks. Oh. Contrary to expectations, the headman of Swari has little talent for hunting. However, he knows well the ways of the Darkwood, and his people set great store by his wisdom. Nevertheless, they will allow that he has a per uh, penchant for using a hundred words when ten will suffice. Nice. Oh. Oh, that's kind of neat. I should talk to people more often. Well, talk to people, I mean... Assume things about people and have them get mad at me sometimes. Alright, Ashland, I'll, I'll have to deal with you later because I have no idea what you want from me. You need a boar. Huh. Oh. Ooh, give me a discount at the yeah, end. Alright. You need an Six. escort, so let's go. Oh, that's the store. I thought that was the end for some reason. <laughs> I actually don't even need to sleep at the end. Everyone's full. Everyone leveled up. That's fine. Alright, so I'm gonna save. And uh, give my voice a little break as well. And then we we'll go get Tarion. Okay, I'm back. I rested my voice. I actually walked around a little bit in town and I actually found uh, this old fellow here in the tavern who has the information I need for that quest that I couldn't figure out oh. earlier. A teller of tales in the woodlands, versed in the history of beast tamers, to hear the stories one need only ask. No, all right, guy. I know who exactly who you need to talk to. Yeah. You'll tell me about the monster tamer. Why? Thank you, good travel. I mean, he's. You should just go talk to the actual person. But whatever. On rare occasions, people with the power to commune with beasts are born to the people of the Darkwood. These monster tamers learn from older masters how to bend beasts to their will. Commune with beasts? Nay, that does not sound like father. 
The neighboring tribe, the people of the Greenwood, also had monster tamers in their midst. Hmm, the people of the Greenwood. Yet tragically, they sought to use forbidden magic and lost their minds to monsters, turning on the very people they meant to protect. Crivance, that's it! I beg your pardon for the outburst. Truth be told, I am searching for my long lost father. He was suddenly taken by a furious frenzy as if possessed. I saw myself, even as it happened, a giant serpent coiled around his shadow. And in the next instant, my father was gone. Before he lost his wits, my father would tell all and sundry that he was a descendant of monster tamers. I believe now that he resurrected their forbidden magic. According to the legend, the Greenwood tribe was defeated and driven away by the people of Darkwood. So dangerous was the magic that they dared to dabble in. God's mercy to you. I am one step closer to the edge, and I'm about to break. My father is indeed under the thrall of some beast, and I have no choice but to slay his captor. My journey to save my father must continue. Perhaps in our wanderings we shall meet again. But for now, fare thee well. Alright, see ya, man. I got a slippery nut. I don't even... I, I'm guessing that increases invasion. Alright, where are we we're off to um Boulderfall. Right? Yeah, that's right. How do we get there? <laughs> I guess we'll have to find the sign. Look at that, a sign just like I like I needed. West Sparky Trail to Boulderfall. There we go. Oh no, I should have brought Tressa with me. Oh well that's fine. Who are you? Oh. Where the giant boar ro Oh, yeah, that's right. I need to kill a boar or capture a boar for that one guy. Not all scholars are suited to life spent haunched over one's desk. This scholar, for instance, would much rather take to the field and seek out wild beasts in their element and face them in battle. For the purposes of research, of course. Needless to say, such methods resort in no shortage of injuries. Wait, can I just go back to town and tell him that? Do I not have to actually catch a boar? I really want to have Tress with me because that's just free money for walking around, but... Ophelia has heals, and Haunted, I want to capture stuff, and Cyrus is just too good to not have when you're going into a new area because he helps find out weaknesses. Man, I can't do anything. Attack all! I just realized there was only one thing that was actually weak to bows. I also just- I can just edit most of this stuff out. I mean, I won't. Because that's that's more work for me. Did they just defend? That's smart. I want to I want to capture that rat kid. Ow. This thing really hurts. I swear, if I go back to, into town and that's, that's not all I need to do, I'm gonna be very upset. I literally walked like maybe 30 seconds out of town, but I'm still gonna be upset. <laughs> Is it you? Mm. Hey, there you go. Hello, friend.
So, that's the giant boar, is it? A fascinating beast, to be sure. Hang on, if I use my head and learn more about it, mayhap I can go on a hunt one for myself. The elders are always prattling on about knowing your quarry, and I'm starting to understand what they mean. Thank you for showing me this. Did I, did I actually bring a whole dead boar with me? <laughs> I was grossly misunderstanding what information I gleaned from this quest, but okay. Ooh, look, I think that's a dungeon, right? A little uh, forest icon, tree icon, I guess. Let's see, what should be like level 20 something? 15, yeah. I could probably handle that, but again, I want to focus on getting the last two guys my party. That's like the first time I've ended a battle as Ophelia. Are we in Boulderfall yet? Or is this no this this does not look like a town? Sparky Boulderfall South Boulderfall Fast Pass. Like people just like leaving single grapes inside these chests. Hey, Primos, you can finally do something. Neato. Actually, no. Hold on. Can I? Can I capture? <laughs> I like how it like not too long ago I was like I I hate um, capturing mechanics in the games, and now I'm just sitting here trying to capture everything. <laughs> Okay, I don't need... Oh, the Majestic Marmot is considerably stronger than just the normal Marmot. Ooh, ooh. I like the tunes. You know what? Sure, why, why the hell not? Thieving tips and tricks. Half a year passed this woman came to Boulderfall with her husband in search of a new life. Though he labors tirelessly for her and her unborn child, she has not failed to notice how his once bright eyes have grown dim and wonders what troubles may weigh on his mind. Okay, I'm not sure how her backstory relates to being able to steal stuff, but alright. No, no thanks. 72. You know what? I'm gonna beat the crap out of you. How's that sound? <laughs> Facing down a tiger. Now I've seen everything. Actually, I don't know if it's a tiger. I should say that. Can I not attack normally? No, I can't. That's weird. Alright. That's fine. I'll have a Pokemon battle with you. What? I'm not I'm not gonna waste my other animals on you. Yeah, there you go. Get out of here. Hmm. we we won. What did we win? Nothing. You weren't even you didn't even have anything in here. Ah, there he is. Man of the hour. Sure. Oh. New weapons for sale. A born entrepreneur, this youth concocted a scheme with an armor to sell arms to the rogues and ruffians of Boulderfall. 
He is wholly unconcerned with the affairs of the town or the potential repercussions of his actions as long as they have no bearing on his profits. Nice. What a swell fellow. The famed treasure of House Ravis indeed. His name is Tyrion, and he is a thief. He is a lone wolf, as rugged and sharp as the harsh peacelit cliff lands. Roving from town to town, he has drifted into Boulderfall. He works alone, though it was not always so. Few knew his past, or have even seen his face, but tales of his exploits are told far and wide. You know, if he's a lone wolf, then why is he gonna join <laughs> our party? He has heard a rumor of a mark too tempting to resist, a treasure said to be impossible to steal, and so he sits out to test the security of the great house Ravis. He will need cunning allies on the path he has chosen. You just said he works alone! Alright, uh, man. I like having Cyrus because he exposes weaknesses. It's just, it's such a good ability to have going into a new, new spot. Plus he has really good magic. AoE magic, uh. But I do want to play more with both of these gal. You know what, um. I, I need a healer, I need a healer, sorry. Hind. The freaking Suck it up. your your reputation has improved because the thief is in town. The usual. Those. As you like it. Now I have actually spoiled this for myself, but uh, Terry and his voice by uh, Matsuyoka Yoshisugu, which is just awesome. <laughs> アクター、アイラクター。あ、ネームやつ。あ、ネームやつ。あ、ネームやつ。あ、ネームやつ。あ、ネームやつ。あ、ネームやつ。あ、ネームやつ。あ、ネームやつ。あ、ネームやつ。
A no good tea leaf who got caught in the act just like yourself. So good. Just like me, huh? Well, you look a lot worse. <sighs> yeah, we'll get used to seeing this ugly boat, because I ain't getting prettier anytime soon. These guards think they can beat the attitude out of us. Thank God you guys speak like normal people. And they don't go easy on no one here, least of all teapots like us. So then. Sounds about right. Uh huh? So, ready to be a good little boy and play nice with the guards? Are you? Hmm. Nope, and I don't plan on staying here till they change me mind. See, I got a pin here to unlock the door. Mm. Hey, what do you think you're... Uh -huh. A little busy right now. <laughs> Try using this instead. He nabbed the key. Where'd you get this? <laughs> Snatch it from the guard once he was all riled up. <laughs> ha ha, look at the cobblers on this one. <laughs> now let's get out of here. The name's Darius, mate. Terionda. Terion. Kyodai. Well, Terry, it looks like you and I are officially partners in crime. <sighs> Sweet memories. I just cut them off. Fill it up. Another round. Here you go. Big part, but would you happen to be after them Ravis' treasure? Hmm. If you are, I suggest you think again. Heard another would be fortune hunter was tossed in the dungeons yesterday. What's the count now? A score? Maybe more. <laughs> but House Ravis ain't known to be the kind of those who covet their wealth. Still, poor thieves can't help but flock to the manor like moths to a flame. Suppose it's all those rumors of their riches that keep them coming. Some say it's enough to buy up the whole town and then some. Just one town? What about the neighbors? Can't say for sure. No one's ever seen the treasure. Even that master thief they keep talking about would have more than his hands full. A perfect tale for the tavern. Look, when you've been in the business long enough, you can tell things at a glance. You're a smart and skilled young man, probably have a long career ahead of you. That's why I'll say it once more. Stay away from that manner. Thanks for the advice. Next time, I'll have a tale of my own to tell. They say that Ravis Manor is up at the top of the mountain where only the richest of the rich live. Well then, let's go. Hey, look, swords. Actually, what, what kind of weapons can you use? Swords and daggers, I guess that makes sense. Hmm. 
Ooh. Folk on the middle level are a reasonable lot. At least they don't look down their noses at us like those snotty, uh, snooty nobles. Doesn't mean, doesn't mean they all think highly of each other, though. Where is this? Ooh, look, purple chest. Just stinging dagger. Looks like uh, the thief can pick these uh, purple chests, I guess. Makes sense, I suppose. More purple chests. Man, you are just incognito, man. Like, I, I can't even notice you. You're blending right in. If I didn't know any better, I'd say they were overcompensating for something. Ha! You funny. Yes. Change posts. Oi. You there. Uh, hi. Yes, sir. Stop dragging your feet. Walk with purpose. Yes, sir. <laughs> We're getting paid a fortune for this job. Do it with pride. Oh man, they even have guard dogs. like an army. Just what kind of place is this? Yeah. Those guard dogs look vicious. And that's not all. The walls are lined with wire. One false movement will sound an alarm, no doubt. Yep, trying to scale the walls would be more trouble than it's worth. Mm. Hmm, what's this now? Dakara. What part of no visitors allowed do you not understand? Dameda. The Ravises have more important matters to attend to than to entertain Riff Raff like yourself. Sonna. It won't take long, I swear. I'm merely a merchant looking to. Hmm. Merchant, you say, prove it. <laughs> prove what? I came to show the lady of the house some of the finest fabrics in the realm. Tell me them. And we're supposed to just take you, you at your word. <laughs> if you can't show us proof, you can show yourself out. <laughs> but I. Fine, I'll leave. I'll swear. The nerve of these hoity-toity types. <laughs> Never thought the front door would be the easiest way in. Time to get my hands on some proof. Oh boy. Time to steal some stuff. Like an iron helm. Well, if it isn't our merchant friend. <laughs> Those bloody ravises. Don't they know some of us actually have to work for a living? <laughs> Turn away at the gate. Join the club. <laughs> you too, but why? <laughs> they're doing it to everyone. Rumor has it they're guarding some great treasure inside. <sighs> but I'm not after their treasure. I just wanted to show the lady of the house my wares. Then they told me I needed proof, as if this sack of silk dresses isn't proof enough. Uh. Indeed, you'll need a letter of introduction to get inside. 
A letter of what? Nani? Jitsua. House Ravis only does business with the most esteemed merchants and traders. Yuan. So how can I get one of those letters? It's not that easy, that's for sure. First, you'll have to make a name for yourself here in town. Once you've proven yourself a reliable trading partner, then, and only then, will the Ravises write you a letter. That said, you can count the number of people who've earned one on one hand. Well, that sounds like an awful lot of work. Are you sure there's no other way? I can think of at least one. Lifting it from the pocket of someone who's done the work for me. Okay, you did... A little bit of subtlety would have been nice there. We get it, you're a thief. Don't mind me, I'm just going to, uh, you know, lift that. Right in front of your little friend there, he's looking directly at me. Now you're looking directly, oh man, yeah, all this stuff, that's mine now, thank you. This is so much better than Tressa, man, I can just steal stuff, right? Like, there's a percentage to it, but I mean... Just out of curiosity, how long do you plan on following me? <clears throat> so you noticed. Anta. For thieves, you aren't very discreet. Uh. You're keener than most, friend. <laughs> As are we, we can tell you've come for the Ravist fortune. <laughs> If the army surrounding the manor is any indication, it's more than worth the trouble. And have you actually seen this treasure? <laughs> you don't need to see it, just look at what they've got guarding it. <clears throat> Guards, dogs, traps, you name it, they got it. <laughs> and you came all the way to warn me? How thoughtful. <laughs> look, we've got a proposal for you. And I've got an answer. No. Oh. Just hear us out, mate. We can help each other. <laughs> My partner here has been inside. He's seen the traps they've set up close. Hells, he walked straight into one and set off an alarm. Boy! Shut up! You said you wouldn't tell anyone about that. Anyway, I got out just fine and we're here now, so what do you say? It won't be easy to carry all the treasure on your own. We're offering you a helping hand. Yeah. I've already got two hands. That's enough for me. To me? So, you think you're too good for us, is that it? I'm a thief, not a nanny. <laughs> huh? You're an ungrateful bastard, that's what you are. Boy. Listen, I don't have time to entertain you clowns. I have places to be. Oi. You're not going anywhere. Uh. <laughs> Get out of my sight. Oh, boy. Ori, are you with me, mate? Speak to me, man. Oh, there he goes, reminiscing again. Yes, sir. You won't get away. <coughs> They're on to us. Well, you don't say. Yeah. Darius, this way. Oh. Oh, yeah, got it. Wow, that was really easy. <laughs> Damn, we lost them. If only we just, you know, check under these stairs. <laughs> they can't have gone far. Let's check back the back alley. Third God, we should be safe for now. Oh. That went better than I expected. Almost surely. I wish they could have seen the looks on their faces. <laughs> ha! They deserve it for treating us like teapots. <laughs> we 
might be small, but we're smarter than they'll ever be. <laughs> you can say that again. We put our loaves together. No one can stop, but what does that even mean? <laughs> Take a butcher's at all the lo loot we got. What's that? What? Take a butcher's at all the loot we've got? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's quite the haul. <laughs> Show a little more enthusiasm, mate. This is all ours now. <laughs> right. We knew what we wanted and we took it with our own hands. Jomai! That's the spirit. All the world's treasures are ours for the taking. So then. If you say so, partner. <laughs> I do. Mark my words. We're going to be the greatest tea leaves the world's ever seen. This is no time for nostalgia. I need to get myself one of those letters. Well, first, I need to nab all this other crap. Look at this. These are medium plums and grapes, and I'm just taking them. What do you got? You, you got a pomegranate? Who else can I steal stuff from? How about you? Man, look. What is this? Look at this. Free weapons. What? Man, why do I- why should I buy stuff when I can just steal it? What do you got? And look at all these fruits and nuts that people just carry on them for some reason. Not sure why there'd be like a merchant with that letter here in the like the slum, but you know. A weapon fit for a rebel. Why does it look like a light? <laughs> Spear of justice. Weapon fit for a shoulder of justice. <laughs> I don't get it. These must be like quest items or something. You've been in business as long as I have. The Ravenses will be begging for you for a visit. It's all about experience. Ah ha 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 ha. Yes. Lucky for me, your experience hasn't taught you when to keep your mouth shut. Hey guys, how's it going? Oh, I already stole from you. Yeah, I'ma take that. Thank you very much. Pleasure doing business with you. Now to pay a visit to Ravis Manor. So I'm going to sneak into the mansion. Yeah, what is it? Wanna pair up with me on this? You sure you feeling alright? Huh. The Mark's house Ravis. Just keep quiet and try not to get in the way, alright? That, that's not what you just told the other two thieves. <laughs> what? Alright, look. There's got to be more stuff to steal, right? Cause like, come on. Alright, what do I got? Do I have any good swords? I should really start unequipping stuff I'm not using. Max SP. You know, I'll take that, I guess. Yeah, I remember I stole that off of somebody. Should be a store down here. Oh, right. I needed to bring this woman here, and I have no idea where I'm dropping her off at. A feather saber occasionally puts the target to sleep. Yeah, those, the, soothing, the soothing pain of a sword puts me right to sleep all the time, every time. Just 
sturdy shield, feathered hat, black cap, bronze vest, black attire. I'll probably buy one of these, sir. Actually sounds uh, pretty nice. Maybe I should just, like, let her lo leave. Maybe that's just it. I'm gonna save first. <laughs> this entire train of people is just gonna go waltzing into that mansion. Alright, let's try that. Uh, is that who? Or is it the other person? Honestly, neither of them are very good. Many thanks. Ah, uh, that, that looks like that wasn't the right thing to do. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> okay, maybe there's like somebody I'm supposed to talk to. Okay, now I can't leave. What? Well, I can't leave while I have Terry in. So I just need to find whoever I'm supposed to be talking to. Yeah. Hey, someone just left a thousand leaves, I guess. Slow motion. You know what? Sure, why not? <laughs> of course I'll accompany you, my dear. <laughs> She's just gonna follow me into this dangerous mission into this mansion, I guess. Something. Two guards at the gates. Back and fold on my man. Time to sell the merchant. Good day, sirs. I've come to call on the Ravises. Would you kindly announce my arrival? Oi! I'm not seeing anyone today. Be gone with you at once. Be gone, I say. <sighs> Something tells me this one's bark is worse than its bite. I know. Allow me to introduce myself. You see, I am a merchant of some repute. Hmm? A merchant? A repute, you say? Don't make me laugh. <laughs> you ought not to judge a man by his robes, which is basically just a shawl and a scarf. As a matter of fact, I was personally summoned by the lady of the house. I doubt she would react kindly upon hearing I was turned away. Nani? Summoned? You? Dame though. You think we're gonna believe that cod swallow? <laughs> hmm. We had a leaf for every rotten thief who gave us that story. We'd be as rich as the Ravises. So then. But since we aren't, we're here protecting the fortune from would-be swindlers like you. Huh? <laughs> Thought you could outsmart us, didn't you? <clears throat> Next time you're summoned, remember to bring your letter. Would you be referring to this letter, perchance? Oh. That for oh, some boy. reason isn't directed to a specific person? How did you get that? It must be a fake. <sighs> now for the finishing blow. <sighs> you still aren't convinced, I fear there's not much else I can do. I'll take my leave, but I will give Lady Ravis a full report on what happened today. I wonder how she will see fit to deal with this affront to my good name. Martin. Wait, sir. We were only doing your jobs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you may pass. Arigatou oh, Why, thank you, gentlemen.
さて。Now the real fun begins. Hey, look! An open window. How convenient. I'll just sneak in through that window over there. <laughs> But first, okay. I like how we can just we just walk around, like like yeah, man. Just, there's just six people. We're just gonna we're just gonna walk right in, you know. Vent sleep, huh? I wonder if I'll need that. Some guards, you are. Can't even guard your pockets when I'm standing right in front of you. Mantarian is awesome, man. <laughs> Holy crap. Look at all this stuff I'm getting. For free. I imagine just all the stuff in, in, in this first few areas are, um... <laughs> Let's see now. Not all dogs have it in them to charge fiercely into battle and risk life and limb. This one bears no great love towards his master and would like nothing more than to quit this place and return to his home of Victor's Hollow. Aww. What about you? One might describe this dog from Everfold as the embodiment of canine virtue, given the unbridled devotion he has for his master. Won't well, betide the fiend foolish enough to harm those he adores, for he will fall upon that villain with great vengeance and furious anger. <laughs> okay, yeah, alright, sure. The lone lady of the lot, this dog left behind her home in Grandport. Not a moment passes that she does not think of her beloved whom she yearns desperately to see again, but until that promise day comes, she will carry out her duties faithfully. Man, these Nothing. dogs are getting a lot of backstory. <laughs> Dirty ball of cotton. Oh boy. Oh joy. Weathered boots. Oh, my favorite. A, a, a bone. <laughs> okay. Mind telling me what you're doing with a bone in your pocket, dear friend? Elusive shield. All right, what do we got? Guess I'll put this on you. I guess you can dodge wind attacks. I guess. You got a shield of some sort. Wow, that's a lot of evasion. I guess I should put that on you. Yeah, you can learn something. Oh boy, which one do I want to learn first? These cost a lot of SP to use, man. I hope there's things that uh, reduce SP. Or, like, accessories that give you SP every turn, that'd be nice. Let's see, uh, fire, ice, or lightning. I mean, it's, it's a toss of which one's gonna be useful in any situation, so. Sure, we'll go with fire. Actually, what, what kind of skills this. Do you have? Do heavy fire? Oh, well, maybe I shouldn't have gone with fire then. Steal an item, attack a foe twice with a dagger, and steal HP equivalent to half the damage dealt. That's kind of neat. Reduce a foe's single foe's physical attack strength. That's also pretty cool. Reduce a single foe's physical defense. That's also pretty decent. Steal SP, attack a single foe twice with a dagger, and steal SP equivalent to 5% of the damage. That's actually... Actually, I don't know. That doesn't seem that good. We'll see. Uh, bestow SP equivalent to 50% of one's current SP to a single ally. Alright, bestow SP equivalent to 50% of one's S of one's S current SP to a single ally. Huh, that's neat, and it doesn't cost anything. Well, it costs a turn, but... Also, you probably got a... Alchemist to equip carriage element. Ooh, wow, that is quite massive, actually. Dang. Hey, guard, what's what you up to? Hey, would you like to come with me and help steal <laughs> the treasure you're guarding? <laughs> no? Alright, well, it's worth the shot. Oh. The guard who spends all day staring at the sky might seem to be neglecting his duties, but nothing can be further from the truth. Rather, in gazing at the clouds drifting overhead and contemplating the banality of existence, he is awakened to the reality that he is a figment of a dead god's imagination. Wow.
I like how I've just stolen like a whole bunch of gear for free. Ooh, that's a nice statue. Oh no, is this the right way? I don't like going the right way. I like going the wrong way. Well, where is the wrong way? Is it is it here? I There's a chest here. There's a chest upstairs on that balcony too. Okay, it's pretty bright in here. Do we really need the lantern? Is that is that really necessary? Of course not. <laughs> I still I forgot I still I brought you in here <laughs> Look you said you needed to get to Boulder Fall and we're here and oh That that seems bad that seems like a problem Can you die, die faster? I feel like if, if I don't dispel that or get rid of it, it's just gonna die. Ow. Hey, a plum, thanks. Okay, I, I need to kill you. Oh no. Cyrus, come on, you're fine. Oh wow, oh wow, that was a lot that was a lot of levels. Alright, what do we got? HP thief, shackle foe. Shackle foe seems really Oh actually armor corrosive. It's probably gonna help on boss the boss fight probably so how are we doing on SP by the way we're fine healing grapes oh there's a wall there fantastic it's fine I just I wanted to go all the way around There's a lot of chairs here, man. Oh boy. I recall she's not very good but you know what what what's the worst that could happen okay can we stop with this please oh I can't boost oh snap is that what that- I thought that was like a death counter, like if- If you have this, then uh, you, you can't- you'll, you'll die when it wears off. But maybe it's like a fear counter. It's like, hey, you're so afraid you can't unlock your true potential or something. I don't know. Okay. 
Yeah, thanks. I'll take that. We don't need that anymore. Well, that is annoying. Alright, I remember there's a chest over here. Is the right way so I can go the opposite of that way to find more chests like that one man these things have so many weaknesses and primrose can't use <laughs> any of them Oh wait, I have swords. What am I doing? <laughs> yeah, I didn't need my SP anyway. Yay, level ups across the board. Alright, what's in here? Wind attire. Let's see, what is this? Speed. That's probably something useful to have on a thief, probably. I don't know. I like your statues. They're they're very nice statues. Your house is also very long. Oh look, there's a hidden door. Oh, never never mind. It didn't leave anything. <laughs> hey, surprise them. This is so much SP. Steal it. Ah. What kind of thief are you? Healing great. Oh wait, there's a room here. Oh never mind, it's not a room. That's just more stuff. Oh here we go. Perfect. I meant to do that. To get this invigorating nut. Hey, if you need anything, just say the word. Hey, you're a fellow merchant, I see. Just, just, just hanging out, huh? That's cool. It's neat. Is this what we're after? That's not what we're after. It's a very good chance that you're not going to attack the right one. Yep. Man, I cast this twice and that's already like half my SP. <laughs> Come on, man. What kind of thief are you? Not 
Wow, Primos is literally one EXP from leveling up. Alright, I should probably pop some of these beforehand. Yeah, Primos is fine. She's got 70. So this is the amazing treasure everyone is talking about. Looks like an ordinary gemstone to me. Can't imagine it's worth all that much. The jewel before you is worth more than your mind could hope to fathom. Motomo,それに気づくかどうかは別の問題でしょうが。your inability to discern as much is disconcerting to say the least. Who the hell are you? Not just anyone can sneak up on me like that. I should be asking you that question. Not just anyone could have made it this far into the manor after all. You won't get answers by stroking my ego. I meant it as nothing but genuine praise. Allow me to congratulate you on being the first thief to make it here. You say it as if you wanted this to happen. Just so, we tied security for that very purpose. We figured no thief worth his salt would be able to turn down such a challenge. Go on. To this end, we even asked the barkeep for help. His job find promising thieves and spin tales about this manner. In other words, you trick thieves into trying to rob this place. Think it of it more as appealing to the inner nature. The great treasure of Raven's Manor, guarded by a veritable army. What thief could pass up such glory, such riches? We had such high hopes, but were constantly met with disappointment. But finally, one has proven himself worthy. I should have seen this coming. And yet you did not, and I find myself most grateful for your lack of foresight. So, what's your angle? I need not explain that to you. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Heath Koto. I'm a butler in the service of House Ravis. You expect me to believe an ordinary butler snuck up on me? Anyway, 
Anyway, who you are won't matter once I'm out of here. Now, if you'll excuse me. I assure you, you won't be going anywhere. Anytime soon. Oh, it's on, and you are really tall. Oh yeah, there, there's there's some music. Gotta turn off my headset now. Hmm. Sure, why not? Weak to light? Of course you're not. This is gonna hurt. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Attack the right person, please. Come on. Work with me here. Alright, let's buff Cyrus a bit. Would you happen to be weak to- oh, Man, that's a that's a really big gamble. Ooh, and it paid off, thankfully. Ow, ooh, oh, ow. See, that's why we brought a healer. Ooh, the double proc on eye for an eye. That's fine. <sighs> I really want to attack, but I should heal. I should heal. I'll heal. Ah, 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 what the hell was that? <laughs> Alright, let's go. I kind of wanted to steal something off that guy, but that's fine. Man, that's all you had? Man, I probably should have just attacked. Hop slightly from side to side. As if ready to um, avoid your attack. That sounds really not good. He's about to do so much damage, isn't he? I also I totally forgot about this, but now that I think about it, most of our attacks are actually elementals, so that doesn't actually do anything for us. <laughs> Oh crap. I forgot, I don't have any SP. This is gonna hurt, probably. Ooh, alright, that wasn't so bad. Alright, buff Cyrus. Alright, all you Cyrus. <laughs> Yeah, there we go. Delicious. So you can hold your own in battle as well.
若い者にはまだまだ負けないつもりでしたが。Seems I underestimated you. 何者なんだ、お前は。到底素人の動きではなかったぞ。That makes two of us. Was that a part of your butler training? ただの執事でございますよ。I see you still have some reservations about my true profession. しかし。この勝負、私の勝ちです。Though I'm sure my victory here lends my words no credit. 何 ?Your victory. <笑>これはその腕は、一発の盗賊ならご存知でしょ ?Any thief worth his salt should recognize that band. 罪人の腕は、別名、愚か者の腕は。The mark of a convict, the fool's bengal, as some call it. Undeniable proof of a thief's humiliating blunder. <laughs> Get this off of me. I do not take my orders from you. 当家の宝を狙うような腕自慢だからこそその腕輪は非常に効果がある。I've attached it to your arm for a reason. 盗みをしくじった間抜けの証腕輪を見られるたびそう思われる。If anyone is to see it, they shall know of your failure here today. Why don't you just wear long sleeves? <笑> Why you? あなたの誇りが許さないはずです。取引するには十分な材料でしょ However, I imagine your pride will not permit you to be seen with it, and that makes it perfect leverage for negotiations. 取引だと Negotiations. Well, hello there. You may have broken into my home, but for now, I will overlook your transgressions. Oh, great, more a company. Part of my belated introduction. My name is Cordelia Ravis, and I am the lady of the house. Regards to your decorator, they sure have a way with traps. Allow me to explain. There's a really nice echo in here. I mean, the treasure you were after is a family heirloom known as the Dragon Stones. You don't say. The dragon stones have been in my family for generations. Wait, dragon stones? I see only one. Yes, once there were more. But the stones were stolen during the chaos following my parents' passing. しかしヒースコートがこの清流石を取り戻してくれたのです。Fortunately, Heath Coat was able to recover the sapphire stone. それで、泣ける話らしいが、俺には関係ないことだ。What touching devotion? Is this the part where I move to tears? ですから、関係あるようにさせていただきました。Perhaps, once you understand your place in this story. 残り三つの流石を取り戻したら腕を外して差し上げましょう。If you collect the three remaining stones, we shall remove the band from your arm. そういうことか。最初からその役をおびき出すための。So this was your plan all along. ごめんなさい。そうでもしなければ、残りの流石は。Yes, but please understand, I had no choice. 
愛した玉だあんたもお嬢様も Are you too clever? Sending a thief to catch a thief. So no yo na wana ni kakaru ho ga wari. Tozok no sekai dewa so dewa ari masenka? Don't thieves often say the ensnared has only himself to blame? Ma, so no tori da. Ah, they do. Zeevun to kua shi yo da ga. For a butler, you sure know a lot about thieves, old man. So no hanashiwa izure mata. So de. I dare not bore you with my story when there are more pressing matters at hand. Shikyuke te itadakimasu ka? Moshi torishiki ni ojinai no nara. Will you undertake Miss Ravis' mission, young thief, if you refuse? Ii daro. I'll do the job. それはよろしいことです。では取引は成立でございますね。Excellent. Then I pray your journey will be a successful one. But, but that's it. What? I kind of need a little more information. I hope. <laughs> ah, you're back. いっぱい。But the tale to tell too. I'll trade it for a drink. Afraid I don't deal in that currency. Peace court on the ice, or a Yashkin Shinobi Komi or Shimoketa. Listen, I just came from Ravis Manor. Had a lovely chat with a fellow named Heathcote. Maybe you know him. I did warn you not to go there. So was it everything you expected it to be? All that and more, and now I'm awfully thirsty. I might need two drinks to get this bad taste out of my mouth. Hey, you're all gone there. Yeah, coming right up. Look, you didn't give me any leads, you didn't give me nothing. No information, nothing. And you expect me to find three of these things. What? Please wait. Nanda. What now? I came to see you off on your journey. As it is at my behest that you're setting up, I like how the bracelet switches arms depending on which side. The sprite is facing. <laughs> Look, I'm just fulfilling my half of the bargain. Nothing more, nothing less. I understand that, but. He's right, my lady. This is simply an agreement between us and a skilled but short sighted thief. It's as he says. There's something you should know before you go. As you saw, I recovered a blue stone. It is known as the Sapphire Dragon Stone. The remaining three are the Dragon Stones of Ruby, Emerald, and Gold, each named for Shin. You didn't even tell me what they freaking looked like before I left. 
And if I steal them all back for you, you'll remove this band. That's you have my word. Your word? Well, that sounds legitimate. Any idea where I should start looking? Rumor has it that a scholar in Noble Corps is researching the Ruby Dragonstone. Noble Court? Great, I'll fit right in. Tarion. What is it this time? Please do take care out there. <laughs> Did I say something amiss? <laughs> Never thought a man of my towns would be working for someone like. Ah, it's nothing. You'll get your stones back soon. Just leave the thieving to me. I like Tyrion. And so Tyrion set forth his mission, which be begrudgingly accepted, to retrieve the three remaining dragonstones of House Ravis, that he might have the mark of shame removed from his arm. Little did he know what fate awaited him. Bye, town. Actually, I want to head back into town real quick. One to save, two to pick up side quests, and to three to steal more stuff. Oh, look at this olive. It's only got an 80% chance. I like those odds. Whatever shall I do, says the egg seeking girl. I dropped my precious egg when I was crossing the bridge. You haven't seen it, have you? I'm sorry, lady, but if it's an egg, it's probably in pieces by now. What if it were dashed against the rock? Upon my honor, if it was broken. Oh great, I have to go find your stupid egg. Oh. The girl who found a large egg, she claims it floated down the river. <laughs> Looks like there's another side quest over here. Have I stolen stuff from you guys yet? I think I have. I, apparently I have it. That is a that is a decent bow that I can just steal for 100% rate. Old man, have I stolen from you yet? Nope. Well, I don't want you to feel left out. How about you, guard person? Have I stolen anything from you yet? That is a that is a wow. That's a nice necklace you got there, friend. There's a spine-chilling rumor going around that I can scarce believe. The folk of the slum town are plotting to rebel against the highborn. Garrison may say they've been confiscating weapons by the cartload. Makes my blood run cold and I wonder what his lordship will do. Okay. Is prosperity a sin? I'm pursuing, pursuing a number of projects to improve the lot of the impoverished people of the Fife. Thief. I wish I could tell them about myself, but I dare not venture into the slum town for fear of my life. It seems they're in no mood to talk to me, let alone listen to what I have to say. I'll take that earring off your hands. Okay, seriously, lady, where do you want to go? I've been, like, all around town. Pretty sure I've, like, stolen from everybody in town by now. All right, let me, hold on. Journal? Side stories. Uh, where were we last? Uh, we picked up Heinz, so we were in the woodlands. 
I would give anything to reunite with my dear husband in Boulder Fall, but I daren't brave these treacherous woods alone. So we need to find your husband somewhere. I swear I've talked to just about everybody here. Is this your husband? No. Or oh, you want to join a thieves gang? Nah, I didn't think you would. The thing is, filtering's too much like hard work for my liking, so I want to quit. But I've got to find a replacement for a dude. That's one of the rules of Marta's gang. You'd be surprised how, it is, how hard it is to find a replaceable outlaw these days. That's that's nice. Well, you're, you're a shitty thief if I can out-thief you right in front of you. Lady, where is your husband? Yes. Of course we wish there was a peaceful resolution. We can't stand without losing anyone in a fight, but what recourse do we have? We want to reprove our lot, this is the only chance we have. So this, we're probably stealing the weapons back from him, right? Yeah. Nope. Lady, where is your husband? <laughs> Oh, I already stole all these weapons from these people. I guess I just need to bring them back to that soldier guy. No, no, no. Is this your husband? Geeks, no. That's not your husband. That, that's a lady, actually. <laughs> Elderly woman, Jitsu. old man. Maybe he's in the manor, possibly? We can check, I suppose. Hey. Ada. Hmm, why hello, that light in your eye. You have the look you have the look about you. You have the look about you I like. What? Okay. But at last you're not quite the one I'm looking for. Ah, I feel like I've been searching all my life for that one perfect person. Okay. That woman, I think she might just be the perfect one for me. I have plenty of confidence in my sword. Countless battlefields have I conquered, yet it was only when I returned from the field of war that I realized it. I had gained nothing for all I had sought. That was when I realized what I was truly missing. My other half, my perfect woman. And that woman. Oh, how can I ever get her to glance in my direction? Okay. Is this your husband? Oi. No, that's the guard captain. Alright, well, um, lady, I have no idea where your husband's at. I really would like to get someone else in my party. Just, she just wants to go to part ways. Many thanks. But I, I, I didn't get anything. I didn't get a reward. I didn't get nothing. Where are the woodlands? What? You know what? Well, fine. You know what? We can we can go back to the woodlands. We can fast travel there anytime we want. I'm gonna go try and steal this. This necklace off this guy. So it's a three percent chance, and um, I imagine I can try as many times as I want if I just keep reloading my save. <laughs> Come on, Terry, we got this. I could just hop onto Tressa and probably buy this, but that's that's no fun. We got to do it the stupid way. My reputation in Boulder Fall has suffered. Well, that is a damn shame. I have no idea how to fix it. Except I do. This is how we fix it. Right here, we just we just reload our save. Easy. 
Oh look, the lady's still with us, see? It's all, it's all part of my plan to fail those five times. So, according to like odds, my 34th time I'll get it, right? That's how, that's how percentages work when it comes to stealing stuff. Come on, come on, Tarion. It's it's SP plus 80. I'm pretty sure that's more SP than you even have. Yeah, it is. We need this, Tarion. Oh, man. How long am I going to devote to this? All right. Looking at my recording, this recording session, I've been going for about 90 minutes, so... I mean, obviously I'm gonna cut this part out, but like, how long is it actually gonna take? Uh... Alright, you know what? Let's see. I'm gonna do 15 more attempts, 3 more reloads. And if I can't get it today, I'm gonna take a break. Do it tomorrow. I'm not, I'm not giving in. I'm not gonna pay honest money for this, man. You know how long it took me to get that 30,000? Way too long. I just, all right, there's stairs there. Good to know. I am nabbing this off of you, no matter how long it takes. And it's already taken 23 minutes. <gasps> yes. Yeah, you won't be missing that. Yeah. Yeah, see you just gotta you gotta you gotta let the game know that you're you're just about to give up and it'll, it'll give it to you. Alright. <laughs> now uh I'm probably gonna throw this on Cyrus because his freaking SP costs are ridiculous. Yeah, there we go. And then uh what's What's the empowering stone do? What's this do? Oh. Well, you can have the earring. Alright, well that's fine, yeah. Alright, we did it. We did it. We did it. Alright, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna take a break now. And then we'll go pick up Alfred. Hey, and we're back. Uh, not too long afterwards because of the magic of um, me. No, because of editing. I mean, I guess it is kind of me editing it, so it is kind of me, but also kind of Adobe Premiere. But yes, all right. So, um, she's all right. We got one, one more person to get. All right, Alfred, we're coming for you. I guess we just go we just go north and go from there. Is this the team we're heading out with? I kind of want to have Tressa for extra money, but I guess we don't need to bring her. Oh yeah, also I totally forgot. <laughs> we, we didn't turn in this quest. Yeah, that's, that's cool. Dude, I've talked to you so many times. I don't even... Sure, I don't even remember why you wanted this. Is that so? Yeah, it sure is. You've confiscated all the poor folks' weapons, and not a blade remains in their possession? Fair be to you, Traveler. That's a fine deed, if be true. Says that I, I totally didn't just steal something from you. Now they're defamed, we need to fear the poor folk and the rebellious plotting. Truth be told, I was once one of them, until his lordship saved me from a life on the streets. I, the Hypeborn, have more gold than the rest of us, but they're fair and just, and mistreat no one. Then there's good on both sides, if we only have the sense to talk to one another. Better than inciting a war that'll make everyone poorer than a four. We're all in your debt, Traveler. Woohoo, 2000! I hope Leaves is like... Just, just like a term for coin, and it's not actually just leaves. Like, like they just, they just go picking leaves off of trees. It's like, yep, this is gonna be our currency. Okay, 
What's the actual place we're looking for? Clear Brook. Alright, Alfin, we're coming. South Boulderfall Pass. Boulder Falls, South Boulder Falls Fast. Um, I mean, I'd imagine South would be in. All right, we'll we'll try going south first. Oh, here we go. South Boulder Falls Pass. Yep, here we go. This is the. Oh, there's an. You see that? There's stuff down. I don't actually know if I can get down there. Actually, that does, that just looks like scenery. <gasps> Look, it's an egg. That's like a Yu-Gi-Oh card that I had back in the day, <laughs> when I was silly enough to spend money on those types of things. Totally looks like you can go down here, though, right? Like, nah. All right. Well, that's fine, I guess. Oh, we can go down here and grab this. I do need those all as lives. I've been losing so many characters during boss fights. <laughs> I guess I'm actually just maybe it's just tough at the start, but once you get enough, you know, skills and equipment, it's just easy mode. It's probably how it is. No, I'm just, or that, or I just suck, which is totally possible as well. Man, who stuffs all these grapes in here? That is a lot of stuff. Dude, I kind of want to kidnap these things. <laughs> Sounds, sounds really weird when I say it like that. Also, I did. Do I still have that woman with me? No, I got rid of her, right? I, I totally can't remember. What did you just do? You know what? Whatever. Also, I probably can unlock more stuff for Tyrion. <laughs> Alright, Tyrion, who are we stealing from? They have plums, I believe, so what do you have? Sleep weed, that is not worth a lot, I'm pretty sure. Not even sure what you do with those. I guess there's uh, maybe a crafting system in this. Just one off the level, man. Speaking of, let's see. Ooh, you can learn something too. Reflect one elemental that. I'm not sure how effective that would be. I'll just take this. This is generally more useful, I suppose. Steal SP sounds pretty cool. Share SP also sounds pretty neat. I'm gonna grab that actually. Increases maximum SP. Ooh, that is lovely. When using non-damaging skill on a foe, there is a 50% chance you will attack as well. So I guess that's for uh, when you're stealing. I guess. Hey, random lady. Sure, why not? Mm -hmm. A woman growing a variety of vegetables near the river. She recommends the leafy ones most of all, claiming them to be flavorful whether they are boiled, baked, or eaten raw. Hmm. Want to know what I just saw bobbing down the river? An egg! But it weren't no regular egg, I can tell you that. Bloody enormous it was, bigger than me head. Wasn't there a lady who was looking for an egg? Wow. Alright, lady. You have some tight pockets. I see the item. It's down there. Hold on. Journal. Uh, side stories. Where were we just at? Clifflands, I would imagine. 
Yeah, Kaya Mother of Dragons. What should I do? I've lost my egg, so yeah. There's an egg down here. We should keep an eye out for it. Maybe that's the hidden item. This is not the right way, is it? Oh, that is... That is a very big wasp. Also, I think that is blood on its stinger. That is kind of scary. Ow. Come on, it was, a, it was a coin toss. Well, at least he did some damage. Oh, well, never mind. Get out of here, wasp. Man, I kind of... I kind of want to pull, um, oh, this is the right way. Oh, snap. I kind of want to pull Hanet <laughs> out to, to, to capture these things. Welcome to Clearbrook, where waters are pure and still. That's nice. Can I steal some stuff from you? Wow. That is a very, I mean, it's, it's decent. I, I won't lie, it's a decent axe. Occasionally decreases target's elemental attack. That's kind of neat. 8% though. Wow. Yeah, I guess uh, just everything in Boulderfall. All the people in Boulderfall, just for the sake of it being where you pick up the thief, just everyone has <laughs> very easy um, stealth or... Yeah, uh, steel checks, I guess. Things are a lot more reasonable outside the town. Now look at these. Look, 15% for just a normal healing grape. Holy crap, and it, it, I think that's a child. Nina's brother is the best apothecary in the entire village. I think that's that's Alfin, right? Because he's the apothecary. <laughs> Ziff, Nina, you'd better hold on for me. There ain't no way I'm letting that Vietnam beat you. You hear me, Viper? I'm coming for you. His name is Alfin, and he is an apothecary. His whole life has been spent in the past pastoral village of Clearbrook, where he looks after the residents as a young apothecary. He is not alone in his efforts, though. Zeph, his best friend since boyhood, works alongside him. But when Zeph's little sister is bitten by a deadly viper, it falls to Alpha to fashion an antidote before poison takes her, and so he ventures out to the cave of Riho, where he must do battle with the dread beasts. He will need caring allies on the path he has chosen. I mean, sure, I mean, you know... I'd say Ophelia's pretty caring. Tress is probably pretty caring. Haunted too, or Heint. Uh, I'm not sure about Primrose and Alberic though. You know, they're kind of out for revenge, but you know. Man, who do I want to take? I kind of need to level up everybody, so it's like... Cyrus is just so good though. <laughs> All right, I'll, I'll take... No, that's not what I meant to do. There you go. There, I'll do that. I'm really cutting down on my magic, but I have Cyrus, so... Your reputation in clear, but you know what? <coughs> that happens every time I pick up somebody. I should just go around and try to steal stuff before, and it'll fix it, right? <coughs> Be strong, Grandpa. Ma, ma, to ka dekiru. Anata no kusuri de. 
Can you really save him with that medicine of yours? Oh, just wait. You betcha. Just sit tight. I thought he was asleep at the table. <laughs> okay. Looks like he was just more of a pestle. Bam, that should do her. Drink it down slowly now. I like his hair. Well, I'll be. Thank you, my boy. Ha, don't mention it. Just doing my job. This will stop the coughing for now, but your lungs have seen better days. Try to give the pipe a rest, sir. Here. Oh, Alfin, thank you ever so much. How blessed we are to have an apothecary like you in our little village. It's not much, but please. Nah, it's on the house. Why don't y'all hold on to that and buy something tasty for you and your grandpa? I'll be back to check in on him, okay? Oh no! Oh no, there's an ant! Oh no! This, this isn't how it's supposed to be. It's still winter. It's still cold. You're not allowed to come out yet. Oh, man. I need to hide my snacks. All right, well, <laughs> uh, in this age, the arts of medicine and healing are still in their infancy. With disease and illness rampant, the people rely on salves and tinctures fashioned by apothecaries. Mama. Did you see me, Ma? I whipped up an anti tusive elixir like you wouldn't believe. Can't believe it's been a year already. Am I any closer to being the man I want to be? The man he was? Alfin, I've been looking all over for you. Hey, is Zef done for the day? Yeah, only two patients a day. Having you around sure eases the burden. If only I could convince you to quit giving out discounts. Did he just straight up took it for free or did it for free? Oh, come on. The poor gal has enough trouble looking after old Alec. I can't very well take what little she has. Ha, I'm just teasing. You know that's what I like about you. The villagers are healthy and happy. That's more than good enough for me. Ha, couldn't said it better myself. We may be new to this, but between the two of us, this village is in good hands. Sure is. Plagues, epidemics, bring your work. Oh, yeah. Yeah, challenge the freaking plagues. Yeah, there you go. Wow. I'm counting on you, Alf. We all are. Well, 
Who'd have thought the little troublemaker would turn out to be a top-notch apothecary, eh? We can't all be born with a silver pestle in hand, Master Zeph. Your mother would be proud. Maybe. Anyway, I should be getting back to Nina. Yeah, beat it. Head on home, big brother. Hey, Alfred. We've been friends ever since we were small, right? I know you better than anyone, so be honest. You're keeping something from me, aren't you? I'm right, aren't I? Alfin, the truth is... Master Zeph! Zeph, you must come quickly. It's your sister. These look like bite marks. Alfin, could you take a look as well? No. Oh, Magasero. Ah, you got it, buddy. She's fallen into a deep trance. This is worse than we thought. Ah. Indeed. Nina's the only family I have. If I lost her, I'd... Wish she could tell us what happened. It's safe to assume she was bitten by something poisonous, but what? Without knowing the nature of the poison... Ah, yeah, the wrong medicine can make things worse and quick. Damn it all! What foul beast did this to my Nina? Let me ask around. Maybe someone saw something. Uh, Alfin can acquire and learn all sorts of information from people. Oh, so he's just like Cyrus, I guess? Friends with Nina since childhood, the two of them have grown up like sisters. The, the rather more strong-willed Nina often takes the lead on their secret adventures into the dangerous wilds outside the village. You gleamed new information. So I guess no. it's kind of similar to um to how Primrose and uh well I guess a lot of the characters are like that now that I think about it. Basically there's there's really only four um path actions is what they called in the game. But the difference is that one is like guaranteed for sure, but you need to meet a requirement. So Alfin can just talk to people, but he has to to, I'm assuming there's a level restriction for it. Same with how Ophelia can, you know, just ask people to come with her, but they, she needs to be a certain level, and Tressa needs to actually buy things. And then, uh, I think Alberic needs to be a certain level as well. Or it might be both uh, Heint and Alberic need to be a certain level to challenge people. And then you have the more risky RNG side where it's percentage-based, so it's like Primrose can 
can have people follow her that she wouldn't that Ophelia wouldn't normally be able to take but there's a percentage and then there's a percentage to steal stuff and then with Cyrus there's a percentage to get information or annoy the crap out of them so uh yeah that's kind of an interesting it's it's a way to kind of stretch just four abilities across eight characters and you know it's it's kind of unfortunate that there isn't eight separate abilities but I think it's all right uh, the bite marks on Nina's leg. Are you sure you don't know where they came from? Mm. Mm. I want to help your friend, but I'm an apothecary, not a miracle worker. If I don't know what bit her, there ain't nothing I can do. <laughs> nah. You want to help her too, right? So just tell me, please. Wow, the lo the water got louder Nina. for some reason. <laughs> Nina wanted to pick water blooms for her brother. Oh, I wasn't so sure about it, so I followed her to the cave. And this giant snake came out of the bushes, and... What kind of snake? Was it black? No. Masaka. Don't tell me, was it amber with blotches on its back? Uh. Yeah, how did you know? So. The flame take me, a blotted viper. <laughs> I'm sorry, I know we're not supposed to go there. But Nina wanted it to be a surprise, so she told me to keep it a secret and... Thanks, Lily. You've told me all I needed. You're a brave girl to bring Nina back here. Don't you worry anymore about that scary snake here. Good gods, a blotted viper. A nasty critter if there ever was one. This ain't good. Time is of, of uh, time is of the essence. I I can speak. The poison is spreading through her veins as we speak. I must prepare an antidote with all haste. Mm. But I need to get my hands on the original venom. <laughs> There's supposed to be a nest of vipers in the cave of Riho, yes? Uh. Yeah, along with uh, plenty of other nasties. Reckless ain't half of it. I know, but what choice do I have? Hmm. I'll leave at once. Look after Nina for me. Hold on, Zef. You look after her. I'll go. Alfin, are you mad? I'm responsible for Nina. I won't let you risk your life like this. Yare, yare. Don't worry about me. Now go back to your sister's side. Just... I swear, have you taken leave of your... <laughs> Seth, where are you? <gasps> Nina! Nina. I'm here, Nina. Yokata. Will you hold on to my hand? Oh! See, Zef, she needs you. <laughs> Thanks, Alf. Come back safe, you hear? And so, I have a date with this viper, you see. Oh. We just met, and you still want to come and help me out? Shucks, friend, I owe you one. There are good folks in this village, down to the last, and Zeph's always stuck by my side, so damned if I won't stick by his. So let's go, we're heading for the cave of Riho, just east of the village. We better hurry, for Nina's sake. You got it, bud. Pal, I kinda wanna buy this axe though, cause I bet you can use axes. Yep, in fact, that's all you can use, wow. That kinda sucks. 
All right, let's see. I really don't feel like... <laughs> I really don't feel like trying to steal that right now. So how much does it cost to purchase honestly? That's the wrong person? Not for se Come on, lady! Ah. All right, you know what? Where, where the hell's the save button thing? All right, well, first off... Oh, the left side... <laughs> The left side's idle. Okay, that was confusing me for a second. I was like, what? I thought I had... I thought I had Tressa in my party in order to look at that. Alright, let's talk to people. No. Talk to people. Oh, see, look. I, I have to be leveled C? So, I guess that is how it is. What about you? Discount at the end. The strongest woman in the village. In fact, uh, a fact in which she takes tremendous pride. One of her physical powers has spread far and wide, inviting invitations of marriage from equally formidable men. However, the only invitations she cares to entertain are from challengers seeking to test their might against hers. Nice chatting with you. You know, I should probably challenge you as Alberic. I bet you'll love that. There's a chest down here. Healing grape. You know what I need? I need some gear. Yeah, man, I guess that axe is worth quite a bit. Because this cleaver does 70 uh, physical attack. And I think the other one does 96, but it does reduce some um, elemental attack. But I guess for, like, people who actually use axes, they don't, they're not really mages, so... It's not that bad, but let's see. I need... Should I get this? It's 8, that's a lot of money. Screw it. No, look, I'll probably try and steal that axe later. I just, I just don't feel like doing it right now, so I'll buy the cheaper one for now. I'll grab a kite shield because that's just generally useful. Put it on you. Right, I should have some spare equipment, hopefully. I have an iron helm. I guess that's fine. Black attire, that's fine. S um, speed and evasion, sure. Why not? Yep. All right. Sure. This is this is what we got. Alright, to the cave we go. Oh, look! Good thing we have Tarion still. Dubious Golor. I swear, if there was an accident, I was supposed to be very upset. Hello. According to my research, the snakes inhabiting the cave in Rio, by the large, be they large or small, can be lopped in two with a few solid swings of an axe. The nasty frogkins that roam the winds will not go down so easily, but so long as one has means to freeze the damnable things, one should muddle through somehow. Well, thank you, dude. You just told me Adiós. some... Uh, weaknesses, I imagine. That's a 55% chance. Do you want to come with me by any chance? You're probably more useful than whoever the hell I have. Uh, I, I kind of don't want to take you with me anymore. <laughs> oh my, you are quite a, be uh, a beauty. Do you mind if I take a closer look? Wow. Okay, sleazy old man. Hello there. This old woman was carried to Clearbrook by the whim of fate. Much like the waters of the river she watches over, 
Perhaps she hopes that, in time, it will cleanse her of a lifetime of sin, of banditry, of murder, or worse. Or perhaps she seeks only to live out her days in quiet damnation. Wow, okay. <laughs> wow, that says a lot about your character, I bet. Holy crap, woman! Well, it is implied that she was a bandit of some sort, so... Sure, I guess that makes sense. Alright, let's go. We have the sleazy old scholar with us. Primrose has her own reverse hammer over here. There's just this little path down here that leads to nowhere. Good to know. Cyrus said the same thing I did, huh? Okay, I actually no, I I do need to do that. All right, uh. Why do these things have whatever? Hey, yeah, give me that, give me that grape. It's my grape now. Oh, I didn't even look at um, his skills. I probably should, huh? Oh boy, look at those levels. Alright, what do you got, Elfin? Uh, first aid, uh, single target heal. Oh yeah, huh. O Ophelia is only a we heals, I just realized. Uh, ice damage to a single foe. Uh, cure a single ally of status ailments. Unleash an axe attack on a single foe. Amputation, damn. Uh, poison, a single foe. Revive a single incapacitated ally. Attack all foes with an axe, dealing damage inversely proportional to your current HP. So I, uh, the less amount of HP you have, the stronger it is. And then, uh... <sighs> Secret, oh yeah. Man, it's like 11 a.m. and I am just yawning. Still. Oh, wait, could I learn something? Oh, no, I need one more. Alright. For Riho. Wow, five hundred leaves. Woohoo, we are just swimming in it. Injurious dust. Man, look at all these chests. Hey, look, is that the is that the thing we need? Is that the snaky snake? It's not. It's it's almost certainly the boss. It is a viper though. Okay. 
I do like that there is a there is a turn order um thing. Like there's a lot of games that don't show that. But... Oh crap! I thought it was on Cyrus. <laughs> Whoops! I thought it was on Cyrus, which is just automatically AOE. My bad. All right. Uh, not sure, I'll summon. Man, I summoned you to do one thing. One thing. I like how I literally got the information earlier that snakes were weak to axes, and I totally forgot already. Oh, it's a little ramped out here. It's like, how do you get to that? There's a lot of chests in this cave. That is a lot of enemies. I love how Terry and just sighs all the time. <laughs> it's, it's great. Alright, Terry, let's steal some stuff. Curious Bloom, I don't know what that even does. Oh, that's where we came. There's another just random peddler in here. Mild hazardous substance of small. Wait, maybe Alfin can like make potions. That's probably it. What is this? Is that like a crafting tab? Be neat. Oh yeah, I forgot I can learn stuff. Let's see. This is probably gonna be useful. Uh, poison. Poison. Poison's really good in some games, and it sucks in others. I'm not sure how good poison is in this game. Alright, I'm gonna grab this because it seems like it'd be helpful. And uh, we'll go on from there. I mean, they're giving me a ton of these like herbs and stuff, so Alfin should be the one to be able to use it. Looky here, a patch of water blooms. Next to no water. <laughs> this must be the place. Not just a pretty sight, makes it good biters too. What? Makes it good bitters too? No wonder it's Zeph's favorite. Oh! What an angel coming all the way here to pick flowers for her brother. <laughs> and if you ain't just the fellow I was looking for. Yo. 
Sorry to drop in unannounced. Marina. Say, don't suppose you could spare a nip a snake bite, could ya? <laughs> oh no, don't get up. I'll help myself. Yes. Well, shucks, if you insist. But let me give you a hand. Oh, wow. Good. Good. They're weak to daggers. I happen to bring two dagger users with me. That's actually kind of helpful. Alright, Alvin's probably going to be on... On, um... Healing duty. 6,000 HP. Oh, yeah, that's just... Oh, yeah, lovely. Everybody poisoned. Fantastic. <laughs> Alright, I'm not sure if Armor Cross is going to be that good here. Because I'm not going to be hitting it that often, but, you know... Actually, that was not a good thing to do, because I still need to get rid of the ads first. That, wow, poison hurts! I should have brought... <laughs> I really should have bought Ophelia with me. Alright, you know what? Frogs are the ones that are weak to ice. Fire, come on, burn it with fire. Nope, alright, well, shucks. Ooh, apothecary skills. Oh no, concord, concocts. Here we go, here's how you use this stuff. Oh! Uh, medicinal component, medicinal component, medicinal component. Has this, there you go. Poisonous, uh, soap. So, I have no idea what that word is, but fuddling. Oh, uh, I guess sleep, confusion. Why would you want to heal your enemy? What? Alright, you know what, whatever. Oh, I get it. It just shows all of them. So some, you wanna, alright. I, I gotcha, I gotcha. Um, probably you. Man, that, that poison hurts. Holy crap. All right, this is this is rough. I really should have brought. <laughs> I really should have brought Ophelia. I was not prepared for this. Wow. Um. Ice? Hey, oh, yeah, look, they are weak to ice. Oh, I should have hit them with that first. Oh. Oof. Oh, ow. Ooh. You see, that is, um, that's. That, mm, that hurts. Yes? That did not do as much as I thought it would. Oh, crap. I thought you took poison damage at the start of the turn. Oh, no. Alright, well, I need I need to attack. Tarion can, uh... Tarion can pick, uh, pick him up. Well, it's a good thing I found all these olives of lives, right? Hmm. Alright, please die, ads. Please die. Thank you. Hmm. Ugh, 
Alright, ah. Uh, Healing grape for you. First aid for you. Dance for uh probably me. Or Cyrus. I thought it was targeting me, but that works too, I guess. I guess Cyrus does have higher attack power item too. Steel armor corrosive. Ah, poison dust. I'm sure that was worth stealing. Man, that poison <laughs> really messed me up <laughs> at the start there. All right. Oh, wait. He's not weak to swords. Well, that's fine. I'll just hit this with a stick for now. Uh. There we go. Buff the right person this time. <laughs> Right, come on, it has to be almost dead by now, right? There you go. That wasn't so bad. Hey, look, I got another bottle of poison dust. Or actually, I don't know if that's just... If that's separate from what I actually stole, if it's, you know, all of my drops. Sorry, my hand slips. Oh, you sassy, you. So many sassy characters in this game, I like it. What's that? Take all the venom I need. Don't mind if I do. Yes. Hold tight, Nina. I'm on my way. Like how he didn't actually kill it. It's just knocked out. Uh... Seth, it hurts. Nina. It'll be alright, Nina. Alvin will be back any moment now. He never has let us down before. <sighs> I know. Hmm. When father died and left the two of us alone, I didn't know what to do. The truth is, I didn't think I'd be able to raise you and protect you on my own. But Alf is always there to, le to lend a helping hand. When he told me he wanted to study together and become an apothecary himself, he gave me the strength to carry on. <laughs> He's always so humble, apologizing for being a burden on me. But the truth is, I'm the one who's been relying on him all this time. If only I could be more like him. Alfin! Alfin! <laughs> Did you miss me? Heh, <laughs> sorry it took so long. Sonna. Alfin, thank the gods you're safe. Mm. The venom, you really did it. Oh. I trust you can take it from here. Ah. I'll get started at once. 
Hang in there, friend. Man, I'm beat. I think I'll head home and catch a few winks. Pa, I wonder if that's my house. Take a short rest? Sure. Will you also heal me up and give me SP? I guess not. Later that night. <clears throat> I wonder how Zeph is doing. I shouldn't worry. He'll be fine, like always. You know Zeph. I've given it all to be the best apothecary I can. To be more like you know who. But sometimes I feel like I'm still so far away. <clears throat> all it takes is a stiff breeze to blow this backwater village right off the map. And yet this is where I was born and raised, where I learned my craft. It's got grouchy Gerdas, who, who I ain't never seen smiling. Meryl's got her act together, but she still needs a shoulder to cry on now and then. Gotta keep on old Alex cough, too. And you, Zeph. I've been giving you a hard time since the gods know what's doing. You invited me to study together with you under your father. Took care of the books after we went into business together. Right. What was I thinking? I better stick around here after all. <laughs> but not here. Saate. I better go see how Zeph is holding up. Oh. <laughs> The flame take me, it worked. Nina's feeling better by the hour. Oh, I knew it. With you on the job, was there any uh, ever any doubt? Thank you, Alfin, for everything. You saved my sister's life. How could I ever repay you? Don't even mention it. I helped out someone in the bind. Simple as that. Those words. I remember. When we were still small, and the Great Pestilence came. Father could cure every disease known to man, but for the first time, he was at a loss. Then one day, a traveler came to town, bearing an elixir the likes of which we've never seen. Aye, this'll do it. Thanks, mister. But why'd you save me? We ain't got no money, you know. Listen, son, and listen well. I saw someone in a bind, and I helped them out. Simple as that. Shucks. 
I hope I can do that too someday. Ever since that day, you've worked your damnness to become just like your hero. To help people out, just like he did. Oh, um, is that how it went? Nah, often. We've been together forever now. So I can tell. You want to leave this place, don't you? You want to travel the world and help as many people as you can. Just like him. <laughs> you knew. I'm not daft, you know. But still, this is my home. I know you're a skilled apothecary, Zef. At least as good as... no, nah, probably even a little better than me. But I can't leave you to look after the whole village on your own. Besides, who else would cut your ego down to size? Who will listen to Gera's uh, grumblings and Meryl's tales of unre unrequited love? I will. I'll do it all. Don't you worry about anything. I s I'll see that the villagers are happy and healthy. I swear it on my life. So go out and see the realm, Alfin. Do it with your heart at ease and your held uh, and your <laughs> yeah and your held head and your held head high. Yeah, that's exactly what that said. Oh boy. Well, shucks. Guess what, Ma? I'm going on a journey. Time to see just how far my talents will go. I'm gonna save folks the world over, just like the man who saved me. Keep an eye on me, would ya? Alf! I probably don't need to voice those ones. <laughs> Thank the gods you're still here. Come on, Zef, I didn't ask for a going away party. <laughs> Just a little present for the road. It's nothing special, but. I want you to take my satchel. That way, no matter how far you travel, I'll be right there with you. Wow, you weren't kidding when you said it's nothing special. It was the only thing that came to me. Thanks, Zef. 
I'll take good care of it. Here, why don't you hold on to mine too? Ah, Motion. Now there's a plan. I'll put it to good use, Alf. Alrighty then. See you around. Be safe out there, friend. And so, Alfin set forth on this journey to travel far and wide and ease the pain of the sick and suffering, just as one man once did for him. Little did he know what awaited him in his travels. Oh, we didn't even have to head out of town this time. Oh, and a bunch of more people and side quests showed up too. Well, uh, where's the save point? Alright, because it is lunchtime and I am hungry. Alright, and we'll end it there. I'm, I'm really planning to just smash those last, like, three and a half hours of game all together and cut out all the bits that don't need to be in there. So we'll see how long it ends up being. But thank you all for watching. I know it's been a while since I played this game, but I've spent, like, the last seven, what, seven and a half hours playing it, and I've been having a lot of fun. Finally got all eight characters together, and there's still a lot more to do. So I'm really looking forward to playing this, and, uh, yeah. And I'll, I'll, I'll keep I'll keep making the videos. We'll actually finish this this playthrough this time because it's a game that I really wanted to play. And now that I've gotten back into it, I'm really I'm really wanting to finish it. So yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Sayonara, bye bye.